Mastering yes, no questions with have and has. Hello everyone. Today, we're going to dive deep into the world of conversational English. Specifically, we're focusing on forming yes, no questions with the auxiliary verbs have and has. This is a key skill in English language learning, and mastering it will take your conversation abilities to the next level. Let's get started. Auxiliary verbs, often called helping verbs, assist the main verb in a sentence to give it more context. Have and has can act as auxiliary verbs. They're used in several different tense forms, like the present perfect and past perfect tenses. When we form yes, no questions in English, we often switch the order of the subject and the auxiliary verb. Let's look at that more closely in the next section. In English, when we make yes, no questions with have or has, we change the order of the sentence so that the auxiliary verb comes before the subject. For example, a statement like, you have seen that movie, can be changed into a question, have you seen that movie? And, she has a car, becomes, has she a car? Although you'll more commonly hear, does she have a car, in American English. It's important to remember the usage of have and has. We use have with the pronouns I, you, we, and they, and with plural nouns. For example, we have a meeting at 10 a.m. Has is used with he, she, it, and singular nouns. For example, she has a meeting at 10 a.m. In yes, no questions, the same rule applies. Have you finished your work? Has he finished his work? Now, it's time for you to practice. Take a few statements using have and has and try to convert them into yes, no questions. Remember the subject verb inversion and the correct usage of have and has. Here's a statement, they have a dog. What would the question be? That's right, have they a dog? Or more commonly, do they have a dog? In American English. And that's it for today's lesson. I hope this video has been helpful in understanding how to form yes, no questions with have and has in English. Keep practicing, and soon, this skill will become second nature. See you in the next lesson.